Whoa! Whoa! Where are we? Why are you doing this to me? Because, Captain Fiddles, this is our only hope at stopping him. Stopping who? What the? I'm... I'm strong? Super strong! Super strong? Whoa, look at that! This is incredible! But Coach Pickles... That's Super Coach Pickles to you! Right, Super Coach Pickles. Why did you turn us all into superheroes? What's this all about? It's a lot to explain right now, Captain Fiddles, but you have to trust me on this. This isn't just about you and I any longer, okay? This is about all of us here at Ban Ban's Kindergarten. The whole world may be in grave danger. Grave danger? What can I do to help? Take this ray gun and go find the rest of our friends. Make some more superheroes. Come on, come on, just a little bit. Ouch, my mazoglia! That's gonna make for a nasty bruise. What the? Captain Fiddles? That's Super Captain Fiddles to you, Stinger Flynn. Super Captain Fiddles? Oh, come on, that's just too many words for a name. By the way, how did you earn the rank of Captain? Enough! Now, I know this is a lot of responsibility to put on you, but the world needs us, Stinger Flynn. So what do you say, huh? Will you answer the call? Uh, yeah, you can consider me super disinterested. Uh, what in the world? Why, you little... Get back here! I'm gonna make it! I'm gonna make it! Oh, man, this is definitely not good. Ugh, my ectoderm! Now I'm gonna have two bruises. No, no, wait! Please, Captain Fiddles! There has to be another way! If only there were, Singer Flynn. If only there were. Ow! Whoa, whoa, what's happening to me? Hey, hey, this is a pretty good look! I feel pretty limber and stretchy. Hey, this is kind of nice. I'd call it super nice. Super nice? Sorry, I, uh, I don't know why I keep emphasizing the word super when I say things. Oh yeah, that's the stuff. Now nothing will ever be out of my reach again. Wise of you to fuel up, Stinger Flynn. The world is at stake, and without a team of superheroes, we could lose everything. Will you help us? You know what? Yeah, I will. Let's do this thing. I know you're all wondering why I've gathered you here today, super friends. And now I can reveal to you the threat I am looking to eliminate. Nibbler? That's right, Captain Fiddles. Nibbler. Super Nibbler. Up until this point, Nibbler's presence under Ban Ban's kindergarten has yet to cause us any major problems. But recently, that changed. Somehow, Nibbler's discovered that his underground confinement resides right next to the nuclear reactor that gave us all these superpowers. If he's able to break through that wall and get his hands on some of that nuclear core's energy... But we can barely handle regular Nibbler. How would we ever take him down if he had superpowers? Exactly. Nibbler with superpowers would be an impossible foe to overcome. We have to stop him from getting to that reactor at all costs. So what? Our mission is to sneak into the warehouse and secure the wall between Nibbler and the reactor? That's right. And what happens if Nibbler gets into the reactor room before we can secure it, huh? Whoa, that is serious. Yes, it is. Which is exactly why I need an elite team of superheroes. We can't fail. Super friends, let's go save the world. Not so fast, Nibbler! If you want to get to that reactor, Nibbler, you're going to have to go through us, you understand? Down in the dark, uh, you never I don't think he understands, bottom. Coach Pickles. Then I guess we'll just have to work a little you harder to get our point across to him. Like Super friends, gotta... attack! not doing anything to him.
what's the goal? Oh no, Steve, speak, are you okay? It's the time to fight fire with fire! Back to a circuit where all the losers are. And Nintendo Power! Huh? That's racist! I think you mean the council is. Right now! Don't believe it. Leave my friends alone, Harold Bryan. This fight is between you and I. I told you that I would finish this, and that was not a lie. It's time once and for all to end this and send you back where you came from. This isn't over, Steve. We will meet again. Oh my god, Steve, you're alive! I, I knew you'd come back, I knew it! Well done, Steve. Uh, tell me something. How did you... Uh... How did I come back to life? Well, just before my heart stopped, you gave me a golden apple. This apple put me into a deep sleep and just as you guys disappeared into the TARDIS, I woke up. I didn't know if I'd see you guys again, but here we are days later and the time caught up with us all. Absolutely fascinating. <laughs> well, that's a great story, Steve, but let me remind you that ever since we met, we have been promised to go mining, and every time we're about to go, something stops us from going. So? <laughs> Fred, don't worry. Uh, what about you, Doctor? Where to now? Oh, back into my little blue box, just waiting for adventure. <laughs> Thanks for your help, Doctor. Will we see you again? Of course we will. I guarantee it. After all, I am the doctor and I save people. Uh, best be on my way. Take Bye. care, homie. You know, I really like that old guy. Hmm. <sighs> well, when are we going to go mining? Oh, we're going mining, but that is another story.
Another story? What does he mean another story? What is he talking about? Are we going mining or not? Come on, you guys. Tell me. Come on, Steve. Come on, man. We have to go mining. Come on. I've been waiting for how long? Diamonds, jewels. Let's get rich together. Oh, come on.